Hi, my name is Philip Poston, and today we're going to demonstrate how to set the speed using the dip switches on the E24i motor. There are six numbered dip switches located on the E24i motor. When the dip switches are aligned on the right, they are in the on position. When they are aligned on the left, they are in the off position. All six switches are read only at power up, which means any changes to the switches will not work until the power is cycled to the E24i. The first switch is the motor rotation selector switch, which determines the forward motion of the product. When this switch is in the on position, the motor will run in a clockwise motion. To reverse the flow of product on the conveyor, move the switch to the left or off position and then cycle the power to the E24i. The second switch is the dynamic braking switch. When the switch is in the left or off position, the dynamic motor rotation will stop abruptly when the motor is turned off. When the switch is in the right or on position, the motor will coast to a stop when it is turned off. Switches three through six are speed control switches. When all switches are turned to the on position, the RPM of the motor will slow to 50. When switches 3 and 4 are off and switches 5 and 6 are on, the RPM of the motor will read 110. When all the switches are in the off position, the RPM of the motor will increase to 350. Refer to the dip switch settings on the motor for information on various speeds. For more maintenance tips and information, please contact your Hytrol Solutions provider.